Princess of Wales shopped shoppers when she stopped by a discount retailer to buy presents for her children. Catherine mixed with the shoppers in the discount store the range while accompanying Prince George and Princess Charlotte. Kate was photographed at the cash register while she was waiting to pay. She lined at the registers after purchasing trolley loads of artwork, children's books, and art supplies. I did a double take when I saw her, one mother remarked. You wouldn't anticipate seeing royals at the range to be shopping. It is thought that Kate was shopping for other royals. The royal chose gifts while appearing to be any other shopper. The Duchess had her brunette hair pulled back into a ponytail and wore casual clothing. Only a 15-minute drive from Sandringham, Kate was seen shopping at the range in Norfolk. The mother of the woman who saw Kate claimed that she did not recognize her until she saw George and Charlotte in the store in Kings Lynn, Norfolk. She remarked, I recognized Charlotte with a red bow in her hair and little Prince George holding Kate's hand. Their security guards kept a low profile, so they appeared to be just another family out shopping for last-minute Christmas gifts. I worked up the guts to ask Kate if she would take a selfie with me and my kids when she arrived at the checkouts. She kindly replied, no. She was extremely sweet, saying that all she was doing was a little shopping. T's one of the most well-known discount merchants in Britain. The Reigns creator, though, is a larger-than-life figure who rose from a modest Plymouth upbringing to become a successful businessman and billionaire. Businessman Chris Dawson, the son of a market trader, was born in February 1952. He had dyslexia and suffered in school, dropping out at the age of 15. The young man then began working as a fish vendor in Plymouth, peddling his catch out of the back of his truck. Before establishing CDS Superstores in 1989, he also operated a perfume and jewelry business out of a suitcase. He opened the range home, garden, and leisure in 1989, marking the beginning of his lucrative company. The market trader, who compares himself to Derek Trotter of Only Fools and Horses, identified the secret to success immediately, and the range went on to become one of the UK's fastest-growing stores. Even his license plate reads DEII Boy. His estimated fortune as of April 2015, according to the Sunday Times Rich List, was £1.65 billion. When Sarah attempted to purchase a watch from his stand, but ran out of money, he introduced them.